Hi, so long time no talk. I haven't really vlogged or recorded anything in the past like three weeks because I've been sick, but I'm finally feeling better and I want to show you guys something. I finished my final poster project, which I talked a little bit about in a previous clip, but I did a final poster project. So we had a portrait project in one of my design classes where I got to design three posters based on a subject of my choosing of a portrait of character, person, whatever, and I decided to do Julian. <laughs> If you guys don't know, I'm like a huge fan of his. I'm literally wearing his hoodie right now, unironically, while filming this. Um, but my final portrait poster project of this is due at tomorrow, and I printed everything, and I wanted to show you guys the final posters. I did three. One I did above, about Aries Kitchen, his cooking show, and then I did one on his dogs and the Dink fam. Um, I really like this one. And then this one I did just about him and kind of his like Twitch streams and just like brand image. So I did three different posters that took so much effort. This has been a five week project. So the first one I did, it was kind of like punk inspired. I wanted a lot of texture and layering and shapes and a lot of like stuff like that. And that had such a fun adventure to go with it. And then the second one, I wanted to focus more on line work and just kind of like using brush tools and drawing it myself just to kind of add a cool layer element of like drawing just to experiment with different tools in Photoshop and Illustrator. And then the final one I did a cooking show and I did a lot of like graphic elements of drawing out the cooking utensils and editing the images and like finding found imagery. It's been such a fun project. I'm actually in like an hour and a half going back to campus because I want to risograph print the this one. I was messing around with the threshold layer in Photoshop and I got this really cool effect and I want to risograph print it and see if, what texture I get. So that's just experimental but for fun and I haven't used the risograph before. I've been certified but I've been like wanting to use a project for it so I think it'd just be fun to have that added element but I'm so proud of this project. It's been so much fun. I've worked so hard on it and I'm really really proud of the things I made. <laughs> but yeah, things are going really well today. I need to, before I go risograph print, I want to get some other projects done. I'm working on some flat plans for one of my final projects in my image communication class, so I need to like kind of get, so we're doing like kind of a zine, like an art book, so I have to figure out like I have to I have to format the images and like figure out a template for the images I want to use because I'm doing mine about books and like the progress of books and in certain settings so like kind of taking a book around and taking pictures of it like from the perspective of reading the book and what you see out there and like the progress of the book so I need to figure out like kind of like the template for like how everything's going to be formatted so I need to work on that so I want to get a little bit of work done on that but I'm doing really good with all my projects I'm in a really good place and I'm really happy and I wanted to show you guys that also today I am going to photograph this painting and start working on some mock-ups of product designs I want to use with it because I want to put it on notebooks and get cards and I know that the print producer I use is having like a holiday sale soon so things will be like really cheap so I want to like kind of like get a bunch of stuff together for that sale so I can have a bunch of new products for cheaper so yeah I'm really really excited things are really going well today is like the first day where I feel like a lot lot better and I have a lot more energy so I'm kind of going to try to put that to use as much as I can but yeah just wanted to check in a little bit and I will show you guys what I end up working on <laughs> So first off, I'm going to have a little lunch.
took like half an hour and that's only because I'm so new to it. I printed 15, 20 copies for $3. That was so cool. That was such a cool experience. I definitely want to take advantage of that resource more and do some more prints because it's so cheap. I think I might sell the ones I have because I have so many of them now or like give them to friends. But I'm really, really glad I did that. It came out so cool. I'm gonna go get boba now and then get some more work done. So you just saw the process of me printing at the Rizzo Center. That was so much fun. I definitely want to do that more. But these two are test prints that I took because I really like the way they looked just on other layers of stuff. This is the master print, so you can kind of see the difference between the two. Um, this one has a lot more texture because it's like dot printed and it is a little more faded. And this one's like on glossy semi-gloss paper, but it's also like a lot more solid. You can really see the difference between the black areas. And I printed like 12 because you're or like, I think more than that because your minimum's technically 20, like they'll charge you for 20. And you can kind of see places where the ink has like not printed fully on different ones. And I think that's so cool. And this is so awesome. It definitely did what I wanted it to do. And I'm excited to show this in class tomorrow. Thank you for coming along with me mainly today. I hope you had fun seeing me work on my projects. I had so much fun. This was such a neat process and it was really inspiring. And I have so many more projects I'm gonna be working on. So definitely stay tuned. I'm gonna be doing a lot more art content because this feels so good to be making. And I just wanna be creating so much more than I have been lately. So. A lot of more stuff is coming, but thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Make sure to check out my Etsy and link below and buy yourself some of my cool art. And I have tons of socials and tons of work so that you can support me in any way you can. But I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for being here and make sure to have an amazing rest of your day. Bye.